Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I've got a Jack Frost build for you guys. Um, now Jack Frost is the pretty much the mascot of all SMT and Persona series um, and so it would be pretty fitting to just make him an absolute machine. Um, just like his name suggests, um, he is one of well, one part of the Jack Brothers, Jack Frost and then Jack O'Lantern. Um, and obviously Jack Frost is uh, has a natural affinity with ice. As you can see he's nailing ice. Um, and yeah, so basically it's just a super, you know, awesome ice build um, and you've got all the amps so ice amp ice boost um, and you've got all the the elements as well freeze so the build overview is basically diamond dust um, which deals severe damage this is the pinnacle ice move uh, in the game and it deals it deals severe damage to one foe uh, medium chance freeze uh, ice amp ice boost freeze boost element boost spell master single target boost and null fire so you can pretty much get rid of uh, single target and null fire if you really want to for you know something else null fire null fire i've only really put in here just to eliminate the weakness and single target boost just to amp up the uh, diamond dust basically but yeah but with the medium chance freeze as well as freeze boost and element boost you're pretty much freezing like basically everyone so well single target at least um and then with the freeze you know you can just hit them with any sort of physical attack or any attack to follow up and then it'll just be an instant crit so you can see how you know this can pretty much pair with any party member really well or any other just damage dealing um persona that you have in your stock as well so pretty basic build um i'll go over the recipes and everything um just keep in mind that there are a lot of passives uh, that you need to inherit um, which means you will probably need to use skill cards um, so just keep in mind with that when you're doing the recipes, but I'll go through that um, in the recipe overview. But yeah, other than that, um, super cool. Uh, yep, yeah, so you can hee-ho your way to the Tartarus and maybe hee-ho uh, Nyx in, at the final boss, you never know. Um, but if you enjoyed this build guide, definitely don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Um, definitely supports the channel a lot and I really, really appreciate it, guys. Thanks again for um, all the support recently and the 1,000 subscribers, which I keep harping on about, but it's just really proud moment and achievement. Um, so thank you. All right, so we'll get straight into the uh, into the recipe. All right, so this is just a fun little build for Jack Frost of the Magician Arcana, and basically, um, yeah, I mean, it's the mascot of Persona and SMT, pretty much. Uh, you know, you heaved your last hold, basically. So, um, yeah, so Diamond Dust is obviously the pinnacle move of um, Ice, and Jack Frost is you know Ice sort of Persona, and yeah, it's just really cool to have him. Um, you can basically build them into pretty much anything you want um inherit any skills you want but obviously the ice just kind of fits and this thing actually is just an absolute beast um especially if you just max out the magic stat on them um yeah just ice amp um you know freeze boost ice boost element boost like you can pretty much just like instantly kill people pretty much um and if you don't you freeze them and then you can get someone else to instantly kill them so so um again so there's a lot of inheritable skills that you need um as you can see in the element section so there's about six um, and Jack Frost can only inherit three. Uh, oh, actually, three or four. But basically, he can't inherit all six. Um, so that means there will be some skills that you will require skill cards. And again, skill cards, um, these, especially these types of skills, require high level um, rank 10 and rank 11 skill cards, which you'll need to be in the high levels of Tartarus uh, in order to get them. So um, without further ado, uh, I will leave the left and right chains up at the moment. Uh, keep in mind that. The left and right chains are all just sort of based on your fusion settings. So if you don't have the DLC, go to your fusion settings, switch off all the DLC or all the personas, in fact, that you don't actually have. Um, and then it will give you a left and right chain block that can actually be useful. Um, so as you can see here in this one, in the left chain, there's not, you know, not really any requirements or any like rank 10 requirements. Um, I do have Satan because Satan is the one that has diamond dust in my party at the moment. Um, however, obviously, Gabriel is the lowest persona lowest level persona that you can get diamond dust on um, but you can see in the right chain uh, Kamo Susano um, is actually a DLC persona so I will be using Kamo Susano to get um, to fuse this particular Jack Frost um, however you won't obviously you don't need it you can just go to your fusions and they switch that off and then it will give you a left and right chain for you to do um, so definitely play around with the recipe generators I do have guides and everything within the description on everything to do with fusion and um, everything from my fusion builds and my explanations of how to use these properly um, and I will be doing an advanced fusion guide with the recipes um, and everything like that um, just to wrap up everything so you're not skipping through a bunch of different videos but it's as easy as going to fusion settings switching off your DLC and then just re-editing your recipes and it'll spit out exactly what you want all right, so for Jack Frost, for the left chain, we are going to go with Satan with Shikyoji into Scotty. And then what? Oh, well, Scotty learns Diamond Dust, but 
basically you just want to inherit diamond dust um why not why not make it the loan and uh what was it nullfire that's what else what we needed All right, after that, we're going to fuse Skadi with Valkyrie into Ose. And then Diamond Dust, Null Fire, and we'll want an Ice Amp as well. Alright, now that we have Ose, I'm gonna fuse Ose with Angel into Narcissus. Diamond Dust, Null Fire. Cool, so after Narcissus, I'm gonna fuse that with a Pixie into Temlin. Diamond Dust, Null Fire, as per usual. Right, and now that we finally got Temlin, gonna fuse it with another pixie into Silky. Diamond Dust, Null Fire, Ice Amp. Alright, and so for the right chain, we are going to be going with Pazuzu with Loki into Arahabaki. And you want Element Boost and Spellmaster are your main ones. And then Arahabaki with On Meraki into Dakini. And we want Nullfire, oh, not Nullfire, Ailment Boost and Spellmaster. So now we want to fuse Dakini with Orpheus into Hypixie. Element boost, Spellmaster. And then finally, High Pixie with Unicorn into Apsaris. And we want Element boost and Spellmaster. And finally, Silky with Apsaris into Jack Frost. And we want to inherit Diamond Dust, Null Fire, Element Boost, and Spellmaster. Alright, so this is the base Jack Frost that we're going to be using, um, and let's go over and teach him some skill cuts. So yeah, that's pretty much it, basically, for the build. 
um you, you know i just basically taught um I, I have skill cuts for single target and ice amp um as well uh, which basically just means that you know i can just inherit all the other skills that i don't necessarily have skill cards for but if you can you know want those skill cards um as i mentioned before you can definitely get them throughout tartarus um and basically you just need um level 10 and level 11 skill cards with shovel time which means you pretty much have to be like uh you know in in the in the higher levels of tartarus in order to get those high level skill cards um but you basically just activate shuffle time and you can get them and then that's pretty much it so yeah no dlc required uh no real um re prerequisites to require either i did use satan for mine but diamond dust you can gabriel learns it at like level i'm pretty sure innately actually um and as well as scotty learns it um pretty much when you fuse her um, so you don't have to use Satan, and, and again, you can just play around the recipe generator to generate a recipe that suits you. But no DLC, super powerful ice um, persona, especially once you get this to like, you know, 99 magic and everything and level 99. Um, yeah, super useful. So if you enjoyed this video, definitely don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Um, it definitely helps out the videos a lot, guys, um, and I really appreciate it. Um, but yeah, I guess I'll just leave you with some uh, with some B-roll uh, with me rolling through uh, Tartarus with Jack Frost, he hoeing a... Uh, every uh, shadow that I see fits. So uh, yeah, so thanks again for watching and I'll catch you in the next video.